Make sure that there is no screw securing the I.O. tray board to the I.O. tray in a location where a captive riser screw will be installed. Make sure that there are no I.O. tray fillers installed in adapter slots 16 and 17. Install adapters in the riser. If any of the adapters in the riser have internal cables, make sure that they are connected before installing the riser in the I.O. tray. Align the riser with the I.O. tray while making sure that the sides of the riser fit into the guides on the I.O. tray. Insert the riser, then press the riser into the I.O. tray until the connector is fully seated by pressing on the blue touch points. Tighten the captive screw that secures the riser to the I.O. tray board. Align the I.O. tray with its opening in the rear of the chassis and insert. 